So yeah, our water heater basically exploded. Well, it wasn't really an explosion per se, but it was a blowout right here where the water heater was. There's the cold, there's the hot. Right here, there was a crack in the foundation and there was a slab leak. Flooded this room. And luckily my son was playing with my dog in this room and said, Lulu threw up, Lulu threw up. And I, I ran in the room and the water, hot water by the way, because it was hot water that was leaking. The water was above my feet. And I'm like, well, how much did she throw up? And then I realized it was just water. And then I saw the whole room was flooded. And if that wasn't enough, I guess it was a blessing in disguise. We found out we had termites. So I'll link up in the video right now of a previous video we did for this one. There's no more termites in the house, subterranean, or I think they call them dry rot termites. The ones that fly in the ceilings and in the walls, they don't go into the ground. So now we're basically dealing with this right now. We're gonna learn from it and move on. One key tip for all of you watching is check your water meter to see if there's any type of leak. Uh, usually a water meter will have it through a dial or digitally and will show you if there's a little leak. And if there is, get a professional out here as fast as possible. We got a brand new water heater though and we installed a sediment filter as well. So hopefully this will stay clean for a very long time. Right outside this room is where it was leaking as well, right through this hole inside the house. So that's what's been going on with us lately. Let me get some peach jam. Come on, Tali. Let's go. Let's go. I know this room is all screwed up. Bye, everybody. Happy gardening.